That shootout left not only drivers frustrated, but a family wondering what went wrong. Fox 11's Phil Schumann spoke to them. He joins us live tonight in the Sepulveda Pass. Phil. Well, it was a brutal morning commute. The freeway now open in both directions. The sister of the suspect tells me this afternoon she just can't understand why her brother would do the things that the highway patrol is alleging. My reaction to that information was uh, shocking. I was appalled. Um, I was dismayed. It doesn't sound like anything that Michael would do. That's Tajane Northcutt, and that's her younger brother Michael's red Mustang by the side of the southbound 405 freeway, 2.45 a.m., surrounded by first responders. What the CHP says happened makes no sense to her. They noticed that the airbags were deployed, and that's when they saw the male adult outside of the car. When they were going to uh, well, do a welfare check, make sure he was okay, that's when he reached into the uh, vehicle, pulled out a gun, and started shooting at the officers. Northcutt was transported to the hospital, where the married father of four underwent surgery for bullet wounds. The CHP officers were unhurt. The shock of seeing his car on the news was mind-blowing. Um, and then when we attempt to reach out for information, we get nothing except for it's under investigation. Um, so that brought about a whole nother realm of mixed emotions, feelings, you know, panic. Through the valley area, through the valley floor, it is completely stopped. It is a giant parking lot. The 405 was shut down in both directions for hours as investigators worked. Wow. Causing a morning commuter nightmare as drivers searched for alternate routes. As the morning went on from Sky Fox, you could see all the evidence markers showing the aftermath of what was described as a shootout. Yeah, that was a shootout. Northcutt remains hospitalized at UCLA's medical center while friends and family wait to see him and wait for more answers. You're saying this makes no sense. This is, this is out of character for him. Absolutely no sense for Michael to randomly pull a gun out and start shooting at police. Doesn't make any sense um, at all. He, that, that's not even his character. Like I said, he's been a role model in the community, raising up little boys. He has four kids of his own. He has a lot on the line. So back live, the family tells me they were waiting for an afternoon visit with the CHP for an update on his condition they described as critical. Still a mystery as to what led to that wild shootout in the early morning hours. It's not clear whether the suspect is able to talk to investigators at all. Live in the Sepulveda Pass, I'm Phil Schumann, Fox 11 News.